Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the AWL Arena. The Holy Contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing Hush, making his withering from Tokyo, Japan. The Prince of the Pinfall, Heath Me Ryuji. Heath Me Ryuji, erstwhile of Nippon Yokata, entering this match with a record of 15 wins. 21 losses for a win-loss ratio of minus six. He is called the Prince of the Pinfall because he knows every possible pinning con condition, pinning predicament, pinning combination that there is. A true specialist in every sense of the word. But he's gonna have his work cut out for him. He's gonna need every ounce of leverage that he can find in order to pin the shoulders of this man, question mark, to the mat. Ominous, isn't it? I assure you we did pay the electric bill. There he is. And his opponent, making his withering from the sands of time, accompanied by the manipulator, representing Monster Union, King Akira. King Akira coming into this match, a perfectly balanced record of eight wins and eight losses in his AWL career. And one of those losses was his fabulous power on power match with Jigoku Destroy, who you saw yesterday in our opening contest. By the way, we're still waiting for an announcement from the AWL commissioner's office on what's gonna happen now that we don't know the schedule for title defenses of Matt Classic Senior. That's gonna have to be dealt with somehow. We will hopefully have more information for you by the end of AWL 327. King Akira versus the Prince of the Pinfall, Ifumi Ryuji. 10 minutes on the clock in this singles contest. Senior official Joey Babaganoush calls for the bell. Tachiai, oh! Interesting, blow for blow there, and boom, and a ministerial suplex. Referee wasn't able to get a clear shot, a clear visual of the shoulders of Hikami Ryuji, therefore a slight delay on the count there. Swing and a miss with a big kick, and backstabber by Hikami Ryuji. The Prince of the Pinfall looking for his first win Actually, I believe his first win this season. King Akira looking to come out on the positive side of the win-loss records, eight and eight. A balance you do not want to strike in life. And there we go, another ministerial suplex doesn't hold him for a bridge this time. And now just twisting at the head, the neck. The human neck is not a bendy straw, not meant to do that. One minute in. Manipulator happy with the results of the match so far. And some unorthodox offense, grabbing at the bandages. And driving, using all of his weight to drive the head of his opponent, shoots the half into the cover one. The Prince of the Pinfall with the first cover of the match, first legit cover of the match. Dragon, snap dragon suplex, but he felt the legs of his opponent hit the ropes and that was the Reason he didn't bother to hold on to the pin in that situation. Great ring awareness by Hifumi Ryuji. And a flying knee. He's calling for something. He wants his opponent back to his feet. King Akira reeling. King Akira gets sent down to the outside. Hifumi Ryuji goes out 
and tries to press the advantage. Of course, Hikamiya Ryuji knows, everybody knows, you cannot pin a man on the outside. So quickly, the action turns to the ring. Abdominal stretch with a claw hold. And Hikamiya Ryuji knows how to transition this. Notice how he moves his leg to cater his opponent off balance into a pin. One, two. Kick out a very difficult way to pin your opponent, but if it works, it works perfectly. Just didn't happen, just didn't in that situation. Up, down, the pinfall driver. One, two, no. Two and a half, says senior official Joey Baba Ganoush of the famous Baba Ganoush wrestling family. Now stomping away at the arm of the opponent. That's a good idea. Oh, wait, what is this going to be? Up, whoa, running neck breaker. Quick cover, hook of the legs. One, kick out. Hikamiya Ryuji, he knows he's a specialist. He knows he's got really only that one trick. And the headbutt as King Akira leaves the ring to catch a breath, recuperate. The referee will begin the 20 count on the outside. Standard Japanese wrestling rules apply across the steel superstructure. Of the ring goes the head of Hikamiya Ryuji. Coming up a little later tonight, we're going to have an Intercontinental Championship match. The International Challenger, the parade of International Challengers, let's call it that, will continue. But right now, this is all about King Akira. Getting actually pretty well manhandled by Hifumi Ryuji. I'm a little surprised by this, to be honest. The man who gave Jigoku Destroy such a challenge Wait a minute, there's a feeder on the ropes, a feeder on the ropes! And he threw to Yuji, can't even win when he cheats. He threw to Yuji, a skilled wrestler. I just think he gets in his own way a lot of the time. Most of his losses, most of his 21 losses, he threw to Yuji, come from his time in Nippon Yokata, that's now thankfully defunct nationalist stable and big splash in the corner from the I'm not gonna call him a funky pharaoh because I don't know if he was a pharaoh claw slam a touch of Anubis to the one two three no oh! very very close there I believe King Akira thinks that might have been a three count, but no. The decision of the referee is final and sacrosanct. And once again, knees go call. down. Five minutes. Five minutes and unbeknownst to anybody, I believe the manipulators stuck a, a steel chair, snuck, SN, SN, snuck the steel chair into the ring. Flurry of offense with a sling blade to finish it off. We're more than halfway through the allotted time of the match. I would hate to see this one go to a time limit draw. We've already had one of those this week. I don't want to see another. And boom! All the way to the biggest, heaviest, strongest member of Monsta Union. The ever silent King Akira. Irish whip. In and oh, oh! Sent him into the corner, but sent him tumbling over the ropes. And the manipulator having to help her, her mummy up to the uh, up to the up to his feet. With four minutes on the clock, this could be an upset for Hifumi Ryuji. As they continue to brawl on the outside. Missed with that spin kick, but a clubbing blow connects. And up, down, around, can he hook him up? Yes, he can! And the manipulator gets involved. One, two, three, he, foo, me! He's me, Ryuji. He had King Akira there, and now, okay, he's lost it. Uh, yeah, he's me, Ryuji, he's not trying to win this. He's just trying to hurt his opponent at this point. And wait a minute. Oh my God, from the sands of time. The dark powers of ancient Egypt for the one, two. Some will look me, some will look me. Three minutes, three minutes left. Reviving from the dead, returning from the next world. 
King Akira with renewed life, renewed energies, as if ripped straight from the pages of the Book of the Dead. King Akira, your victor. Viva Monster Union. He won't say it, so I will. Here is your winner. And just like that, King Akira moves to the positive side of the win-loss rankings. Tomorrow, the newest of Dr. Jigoku's augments makes her singles debut. Ashtamo Suzuku.